Hello and welcome to Nita in Kitchen. Today we will make veg burger. Let us look at the ingredients. We need 3 medium sized boiled potatoes, 1 cup breadcrumbs. Here we have used fresh breadcrumbs. You can watch my video for breadcrumbs to make them at home. 1 finely chopped green chili, 1 fourth teaspoon cumin seeds, 2 tablespoon finely chopped coriander, salt according to taste, oil to shallow fry or deep fry the tiki or potato stuffing, burger bread, for topping we need cabbage leaves, round sliced onions, round sliced tomatoes, tomato sauce and meolite burger sauce. First of all we will grate the potatoes. It is easier to grate potatoes when they are hot. Also the lumps are not formed. Our grated potatoes are now ready. Take them out in a bowl. Now add cumin, chopped green chilies, chopped coriander leaves, salt and breadcrumbs. Mix everything very well to make a dough. Put a little oil in the dough so that it does not stick. Now grease your hands with oil. Make medium sized ball out of the dough and shape it well for the burger stuffing or aloo tikki. Make it as thick and big as your burger bread. Shape it well between the hands. Make a proper shape. Now we will shallow fry it in a pan. Put on a burner and place a pan on it. If it is non-stick you will require very little oil. Here we are using non-stick pan. Put little oil because here we are shallow frying the tikki or potato stuffing. Now place the potato stuffing on the pan. We have made another potato stuffing or alu tikki and cook them till they are golden brown in color. Put oil whenever required. Keep the flame low. By the time we will cut slice our burger bread from between. See the lovely golden brown color coming in the alu tikki or potato stuffing. Let it cook from all sides. Now put a little oil on the flat pan and place the burger bread on it. Cook it well for some time till it becomes a little brown in color. Here we have used brown burger bread. You may use white if you want. Brown burger breads are good for health. Now spread the white mayo light burger sauce on the inner side of the burger bread. Spread it generously. Now put the round sliced onion, then the layer of tomatoes and now put the yummy potato tikki on it. If you like you may put a cheese slice over the tikki. You may skip it if you don't want. Now put the cabbage leaf and finally the other burger top. Now add a little sauce to make a yummy burger. Our yummy veg burger is now ready. Please try making it at home and share your experiences with me. To watch my latest videos, 
please click on the subscribe tab thank you